Welcome to Tents and Towns, ladies and gentlemen. I've got Peter Snakebite, right? A 4 1 victor against Ronnie Hybrex. Mm. Quite straightforward, should I say, or does that not really tell the whole story? No, it was, uh, I felt fantastic uh, on the practice board and got up there, and then uh, all the crowd started singing my name, and I was. I got all emotional, like that. I see. And I was like, oh, I was trying to stop tears coming down my face. And I was like, crazy. Uh, why is all this crowd supporting me? It's not only Michael and Phil, to be honest, or Gary Anderson. Yeah. And for them to support me this early in a tournament, it's, it's brilliant. You know, they've done it in a final for me, and that helped. Yeah. And tonight it helped, but it helped and hindered in a way because I yeah. couldn't I couldn't focus and yeah. I wanted to have a really good performance. Yeah. I wanted to go up and you know get up 108 or 110 or something like that. Uh, but it didn't happen to win. Yeah, it, it is. And you know, perhaps the massive average wasn't there, but some nice big three figure check out to 144, 121 and 111. Uh, of course, coming at oh, the right times. They, uh, yeah, uh, especially the 121. Yeah. Uh, uh, Ronnie had hit 180 to leave 80, and uh, I had to take that 1 2 1 out, obviously. And then, obviously, the 111, that's what it really, it really mattered. Uh, so that's why I took a little step back, took my time, because I haven't been missing 32. And earlier on in the match, I was. But on the practice board, I'm not missing it. It's like crazy. Uh, so I was just like, yeah, I'm pleased with, pleased with a yeah. win. and. Yeah get on the practice board and prepare for the next round. Yeah, and of course in the next round, um, Kyle Anderson or Andy Hamilton, mm -hmm. and no disrespect to those players, I mean, for the last 16 of the World Championship, you know, you're going there full of confidence, aren't you? Uh, no, you've got to take uh, the respect for both gentlemen there. Yeah, well, I know you respect uh, and Andy Hammond, former finalist. Yes. Carl Anderson last year, nine darts. He did, yeah. You know, right, right. and he's done fantastic in Australia, and he's doing fantastic for Australian yeah. darts. Uh, so I won't take none of them guys lightly. I'll, I'll pretend I'm playing Michael Van Guren or Phil Taylor or Gary Anderson. Yeah. That's the respect they'll yeah. get, get from me, yeah. and that's every guy I play so far. I'm doing exactly the same. Yeah. I'm not playing that person. I'm playing one of these yeah. guys. So yeah. I need to be focusing 100. Yeah. And. Um, uh, whoever wins out in the match, good luck to either guy. Uh, I'll, be, I'll be prepared and I'll be ready for them. You'll be ready. And if you don't mind me asking, Christmas? Good Christmas? Oh, it's a fantastic Christmas. Totally not good, sorry. Uh, cooked, cooked for 18 on Christmas Eve and then I cooked for 10 on Christmas Day. So, uh, yeah, done, done right. Yeah. So we, had, we had a good time. I got, got practice in as well. Uh, yeah. It's really good. Well done. Thank you. Well How done. was your Christmas? Very good, very good. And I rushed up here today, an accident on the motorway, and I not a bad oh. accident. I got in and rushed in, and I got the interview, first interview. So, uh, But now the tournament started. At least got, you're here. Yeah, <laughs> it is. Well, yes. congratulations, Peter. Look, best luck in the next next yes. round. My name is Paul Sardas, Peter Wright, Association with Unicorn. That was Tungsten Tales, Computer Sharp, and the World Dance. Thanks for joining us.